So let me take this coat off. I need to look comfortable here. Oh, that's that receipt. <clears throat> y'all, I just went snack shopping. Oh, no budget. Not saying that I'm rich, because I'm not. But you gotta enjoy yourself. I mean, because when you die, you can't take it with you. So occasionally, you just need to enjoy yourself. And I'd be like, uh... I need to say this, I need to say that, I need to say this, I need to say that. Because truthfully, I could have done some other things with that money. But I want to enjoy myself. And so, I just got a few snacks. So the first place we hit up was Dollar Tree. And I actually was going to buy my stuff. But then I knew in the back of my head I was going to buy Joe's stuff too. But he didn't know it. So when we got to the restaurant, I said, you know what, to put it all together. And I bought his stuff. And I bought, spent 40 freaking dollars. And got whatever I wanted. I probably could have told him ahead of time, but I know he gets carried away. And he probably would have tried to clear out all the Slim Jims and <laughs> all the protein bars or whatever. So that's why I didn't tell him beforehand. And I also went to Walmart because I wanted some dry cereal as one of my snacks. So I was like, you know what? That's what we're going to eat. That's what I'm going to get. All right. So I'm going to start with Walmart first. And I think I spent like $15, 16 at Walmart. So all the other I spent uh, over $50 on snacks pretty much. Um, so what I got at Walmart was some bread, some Sara Lee bread. Now, I don't know the difference between all these breads. Some of them are what, supposed to be, I don't know, softer than others. I don't know. I don't have no clue. But um, it's a small loaf. It's not like the regular size loaf because I'm the only one who's going to be eating that. And I want me some peanut butter jelly sandwiches. Um, I got me some rice. What is this called? Oh, rice crisp. Which are bomb with peanut butter. But it has to be the apple cinnamon kind. And this is the last bag. So next time I'm going to go... And make sure I can find at least two bags. Because these are better than like the actual rice cakes. Personally. Um. I got. Captain Crunch. All this is snacks for me personally. Um. And yeah I eat dry cereal snacks. I didn't get no milk. Um. I also got. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Um, and then I got the Kella Eggos, the maple flavored cereal. I like the cereal. It tastes just like the French Toast Crunch by General Mills. But to me, to say it has like a better aftertaste than the other one. But they're exactly the same. <clears throat> Alright. Walmart is done. Let's go on to Dollar Tree. I'm actually going to start with my bags first and show Jeff, Jeff back last. Um, just because I can put myself as I go. So, yeah. Also, if y'all don't know, we have, a, we have snack shelves in our house. Right here. Um, the bottom was Jeff's and the top was mine. But I'm going to use mine strictly just for chips. And I'm going to use this drawer for like, my other stuff, like the other stuff I bought. So, with that being said, um, I do already have some things in there. Like, I have a tuna kit, which was actually kind of alright. A cheese stick thing. Oh, I dropped it. Hold on. Ugh. And then I have two packs of crackers, which these are some bomb crackers. I need to re-up on those because those are like my favorite crackers. So, 
flame will jump bag. Which that should be all his stuff anyway. I got these. These are some bomb cookies, peanut butter cookies. I got a total of eight of them, y'all. I do. I have a peanut butter addiction, and these are my favorite cookies. Um, that's somewhat healthy. One bag for better feed three people, so for a snack or whatever. But y'all, they bomb. I like them. I got some Pringles. These are my favorite chips. Every other chip I can eat a little bit of and not finish them. These I will actually finish. Yep, and they gotta be barbecue. <clears throat> exactly. Barbecue. Don't really care for plain. Don't really care for salt and vinegar. None of the other ones. Has to be barbecue. You're right, Joe. I got some pistachios. I should have, could have cleaned them out of these, but I didn't. Oh well. So I got three of those, and I'll go back for some more. I got this right here, which is a fan. Which is pointless. No, my intention with this fan is to, when I do my makeup, to have it dry faster. Because y'all know when you do set spray or whatever. And also, when it gets hot, instead of returning on air conditioner or whatever, I could just, you know. Be fan of myself and it's cute. Right? I could have got more than one, but the other ones I didn't really like. So you should have got your mom. Yeah. Got this. And I I should have got all the mamas one because you know Mother's Day is coming up. So I could have got your mama and my mama one to go on today little Mother's mm -hmm. Day basket and stuff. When is Mother's Day? I don't know, I think it's in March, May, April, June, July, or sometime of the year. I don't know. Alright, my next bag, I got some veggie straws um, by Good Health or whatever. These are actually pretty good. The first time I tasted this was in college. One of my friends had these and they used to get like a giant bag and I used to taste them. They taste to me like plain chips. Like the Lay's plain chips. I want to try one. That's what they taste like to me. So, I actually like them. <clears throat> Um, I got these. These are the Munchy Right Cinnamon Apple Puffs. Like cheese doodles, but obviously a different flavor. Obviously, um, Cinnamon Apple. I didn't think about that when I got those, because I got these to replace of them, because I couldn't find those. The Cinnamon Apple Crisp, but hopefully these are good. I'll let y'all know when I actually taste these. I'll pop the camera on when I taste those. And those are tonight. What else I got? Oh. Dried apricots. These are my dry, favorite dried fruits. I haven't, said, I haven't tried any of them. No, I tried dried um, pineapple. I didn't like them. I, I should have got some dried apples and tried those. That could be a video. Go to the Dollar Tree and get a lot, of, a lot of dried fruits and try them. But these are my favorite ones so far that I always go back to. I got some bugles. Y'all, I was supposed to be healthy with this whole pig and that stuff, but... Some of the stuff, like my chip, chips is ridiculous. Look at that. Well, I'm gonna actually get rid of that one. Cause I don't care for those. What else I got? Oh, I got special K bars. I got four of each flavor. The chocolate and the peanut butter one. And then the strawberry one. Put that in my drawer. You know what I'm saying? And then I got some peanuts. Honey roasted peanuts. Right here. Alright, so that's all my stuff. And then Jeff got his little rinky and stuff. Let me see. He got some chewy bars, the chocolate chip ones, and then he got the peanut butter chocolate chip ones. I doubt he even read this because he don't even like peanut butter. But I do like peanut butter with those. That's what he got. Also, he got a snack shelf too, y'all. Um, y'all see his snack shelf. So we just basically just racking up our snacks. His snacks are going to last as long, so that's why I don't buy his snacks, y'all. Honestly. 
But he got two Rice Krispies. They're gonna get gone <laughs> as soon as he inhaled tomorrow. For real? I'm only gonna take one. Calm down. He got the sex shells too, but he got the ones with the shell on it. I have to get the ones with the shell off of it because it's obviously less work, even though these are satisfying to crack. But realistically, when I eat these, where I'm gonna put the shells at? So that's why I thought about that or whatever. But he got sunflower seeds. Um, what are these? He got the Taco Bell Supreme flavor and then the ranch flavor. <clears throat> he also got some honey roasted nuts. And then he had got three Slim Jims, which aren't the best thing because they probably got preservatives in them and crap. But ain't the best thing for you. Yeah. I use this for Anywho, that's all the snacks he got. That's all the snacks I got. Let's see what the shelves look like right now. Mine look hella hecka. Sorry, I'm trying to stop cussing. Full, but that's because I'll just put everything up to the front because I'm literally just going to keep chips up here. Um, And then his look like it's looking because I actually organized mine as well. I organized um, mine. You can see everything. Um, kind of, sort of, whatever. And then these two items right here, I'm just going to let go of oh, these chips and those cookies. It ain't number two cookies in it anyway because Jeff is sneaking them. And he, like, I don't know. That's why I ain't been eating them because I know he been sneaking them. Because there ain't number two cookies left in there, y'all. And when I last finished eating them, it was almost ten, maybe even eight cookies in there. That was two rolls. Yeah, I'm fat. No, it wasn't two rolls. But yeah, I'm fat. I do count certain stuff because you got to do that with Jeff. Because Jeff will try to sneak. I mean, if it's like I said. still stuff. If it lasts over a month and you're not eating it, I'm just going, you know, trying to, you know, be the garbage disposal. And this is why when I buy snacks, y'all, I only buy what I like. Like, he don't eat veggie straws. He don't eat the, um, the apple crisp up here. Or she just buys stuff. She says all the little individual packs and sticking in her purse. No, so you know, no, I no, no, no. Purse. I buy stuff that I like. Like, these? I don't care for those. He don't like them. I don't like I don't like all that peanut butter in my mouth to stick to the roof of your mouth. These he don't like. I sure don't. These he don't like. I used to like tunes, but I don't know what happened. So to I buy something he don't like for the same fact of if I wanna take my time to eat it, he ain't gonna eat it. I don't want tunes. Same thing with like the cereal. He don't like this one. That's nasty as <laughs> He won't eat this one without milk. And he don't really care for that one either. Nope. So and then the bread, he don't really eat it if he got like sandwich stuff to make with it. Um, but he don't eat peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. I wanna, so I wanna eat a lot of bread. So I bought something he don't like. Try some. On purpose, my ass. Try some. So and I just put my peanut, my bread up here. Where is that? Right here. Just cause he has his box of cereal back here that he has to finish. So yeah, y'all, we just racked up, literally. I didn't have no budget, y'all, so I spent, like, over $50 on snacks. And I already know, put this up, that my snacks gonna last me quite a while because I bought so much of it. Um, and, yes, I do like to buy certain stuff so I can stick it into my pocketbook or into my bag, whatever I'm carrying or whatever, so that way I can just grab and I can go and be good to go. Because the way I was raised is, child, when I went to my aunt's house or whoever house, I had my own snacks, period. And so yeah, <laughs> that's that's another reason why I bought that stuff because I could easily just stick, you know, a bag of those cookies in my pocketbook and be good to go, and I ain't gotta worry about nothing. And when you shopping. It keeps you from spending so much money because you don't go shopping on an empty stomach like and be hungry. So anyway, we're about to eat our Chinese food, y'all. I just want to show y'all that. It was like $50 or more or whatever. But I'll see y'all in the next video that I'm going to try to make more really quick, frequently. I'm supposed to make another video, y'all. And I ain't even finished my yarn twist because I ain't cut the ends on yet. So... Bye, y'all.